Okay, yeah. we're so excited. We've got Boss That's here. That's an amazing story, by the way. We were just talking about that while yeah. I was going. I mean, just the dog's intuition. and They know, don't they, when something is yeah. wrong. Oh, for feeling. sure. Yeah. We actually um, we had an update a while back about um, a dog we adopted out being, ending up being like a diabetic uh, it, it like you could figure it out. Yeah, yeah. Oh that's gosh. crazy. All oh, like blood sugar. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. insane. Okay, so he's adorable. He's so oh, friendly. Um, and tell us about Boss. Yeah, so Boss is about 10 years old. He was surrendered, unfortunately, when his owner just could no longer afford to care Aww. for him. Um, as you can see, though, he's got lots of life left in him. Oh, yeah. Like, he's, uh, he's loving the studio right yeah. now. Yeah, like I think, you know, he still has his puppy yeah. moments from his olden days. Yeah. Um, and so he just loves treats. He loves people, as you can see. Um, and we think he's going to be a great fit like. for most people. He really is a sweetheart. Yes. He came right up to us. He's very, very sweet. He's very affectionate. He's happy to be out and about today. Yeah, I was like, you about, got a lot going on here. What is a perfect family for him? Because I really do think it has to be a good match for both yeah, sides. Yeah, of course. I think a great family for Boss is going to be get right now. a family who, um, who is willing to kind of give him that geriatric senior care he needs. You yeah, know, as oh, we all get older, we all maybe need a little bit more upkeep. Um, yeah. But we think Boss is really is fairly healthy. And um, I, I think a family wagging. who just wants to give him all the love. Um, I do think he can still use some exercise. Exercise, of yeah, course, as you can I mean, see, he's active. It out. Yeah, um, and so a family who's willing to cuddle <laughs> with all? him and then also <laughs> play with him when he has his puppy moments again. Oh my gosh, he's adorable too. Come here. Come He'll get you with that tail though. I know, the tail is getting me a couple times. What does the shelter look like right now? What else do you guys have available? Yeah, so we've actually, we have rabbits, we have guinea pigs, we have lots Aww. of cats available for adoption. And so we're still looking for a lot of homes for the holidays. Okay. Our empty the shelter, hello. <laughs> Our empty the shelter <laughs> event went really well and we were able to find a lot of homes. Oh, Unfortunately, perfect. we didn't empty the shelter, but okay. um, we really are still looking for lots okay. of homes for the holidays and giving a pets a fresh new start for 2022. Okay. Awesome. All right, again, where can they go if they're uh, looking at boss and they're like, Okay, he's the right. Yes. Pick. He's the right pick for us. They can come over to four five one seven North Main Street. Um, we're open today from eleven a.m. to four thirty p.m. for adoptions. Um, they can look at him online as well. Do an adoption application at WinnebagoAnimals.org. Um, and you know we'd be happy to work with them. We're open Saturday as well. <laughs> so if you're looking for maybe a senior pet to help out during the holidays, sure. he'd be a great one. There you right. go. Right, Let's give him the last look at Boss yeah, here. Yeah, we'll leave look you with this here. here. <laughs> Your Hollywood highlights are coming Hi. up next here. Hey.